Hello everyone, I'm sorry for uploading this vlog a little bit late but here's my life lately. Our face-to-face -face internship officially started and today is Christmas Day but I was able to celebrate it with my family before heading back to my dorm. Tomorrow is my first day and I'm just cleaning my dorm after months of not being here. Fast forward, good morning guys! Today's the day, a long day ahead of me so let's eat breakfast! I'm not a morning person nor a night person, I'm just a person, char, kidding aside. So I'm just gonna change into my scrubs today because I already took a bath last night. The towel disappeared because I washed my face so it's not magic. My energy level is normally low even before or after I eat maybe due to lack of sleep but I'm working on it. It usually increases whenever I'm very excited or very nervous about something my usual practice was to gather and form a circle on my hair then tie it like a low bun but it isn't efficient as hair clamps so i changed so we're going down. I brought lunch today mainly because there were no open canteens since it's the holiday and I don't know where my team will eat. So we're here in the outside world now. It's December 26. Nobody's here. We're going to the lab na. It's 7.35 already. 8 a.m. ang pasok. Pero sabi, at least 10 minutes daw before the time. So, I'm going. Grabe, wala ata akong alam. Ngingitin lang ako. Charot. So, we don't wear jewelries kasi bawal. Except sa watch. For stamp. And main plate, ball pens, and coat a notebook. That's my lab gown there. Okay. Sorry guys for being out of breath. I'm just nervous. I mean, who wouldn't be right? I was not able to take a video of the hospital and the laboratory because we were not allowed to have a phone with us. Eventually, our team decided to go out for lunch. So this is Ezekiah just beside our school and I had cream dory teriyaki. After 7 hours later. Oh my gosh guys. It's finally done. Grabe nakakaiyak ayo ko na. Ha. Look at the place. It's just I at night. Sige mag-vlog pa ako dito. Wala namang makita sa akin. Grabe yung tone ko, energetic na pagod na ewan. Tingnan mo naman, nakakas na lahat ng buhok ko. Oh. It's like so creepy. Charot. But you know, God is with me. And I'm hindi ako matakot. And buti naman, may lights na sila here. So it's not that scary naman. And if something happens, I can just shout, charot. So, very masaya, guys. Talaga namang, I super appreciate na medtech. You know, um, magkaibang magkaiba talaga yung um, nasa book nasa laboratory, sa classroom, at saka mismong lab na grabe, ang galing ang galing ng medtex si wala na akong masabi kasi I'm so amazed morning guys, so let's prepare ourselves for the second day fell asleep so I had no outro last night. For today, I tried na magbihis muna para in case if malit na ako, pwede ko na lang dalian yung pagkain ko. Tada! Dapat ganun kabilis magpalit. Pagkasara, palit bukas. Charot, flash yarn. Last January lang ako nag hair clump since pwede pala. Ayaw pa talaga niyong magpatalo. Hi. 
My staple breakfast would always be bread since I could not eat heavy during mornings. Here's me just remembering what I did yesterday so I could work smoothly today. So I was not able to take a video of my lunch and even when I went to the hospital and the laboratory itself because I'm still working on if I could take a video but I think I couldn't so just enjoy the view of HSI during mornings. The next video will be the end of my shift. Day 2 is done guys, uh, last PM shift for hematology. Intern life is real, super toxic today, hindi man super, kasi hindi pa naman uh, like normal day. But mas nakakapagod ngayon kaysa kahapon kasi super daming nagpa CBC. Nakarating na ako safely. That's so nice. Um, first day, feeling mo wala kang alam. Charot. But, as you know na the process, kasi tinuturo naman, you will get to know it. December 28. <laughs> I'm just heating my lunch and refilling my water bottles again. Today is the first day of my night shift and it's my first day being on a night duty so wish me luck. Hoping I could survive and not fall asleep. Let's have lunch guys. So my ulam for today's video is pork adobo. Thank you so much to mom and dad of course for cooking food for me. Like after praying of course, I immediately fell asleep and then I woke up. Of course, that's why I'm here. Then ate my breakfast. Then I'm eating my lunch right now. I don't use fork just because I didn't have a fork in the house. I didn't have a fork. But, you know, I hope I can use my small hands to eat instead of utensils. Yeah, it's okay. Hey guys, third day today. Mailaw naman. I feel safe. Here is HSI and UMC at night, so I was not able to take a video when we took our midnight break. But in the next videos that I will upload soon, I am able to take a video na, and I hope you guys look forward to that. So goodbye. So, it's currently raining, guys. Like, you know, may kasabay ako kaninang kadorm. Ay, kadorm. Katim ko. Kasi kaya hindi ako nakapag-vlog pa uwi. Nahiyan na ko, syempre. <laughs> so, ayun. Last day for my Hema shift. Night duty ulit ako today guys, so it's like double dead for me, char. I mean, super double dead, but you know what I mean, still sleepy and all, but you know, it's gonna be okay and I'm gonna survive this. Anyways, I'll be sharing my experiences in the next few clips of this video after I eat my lunch. Hello everyone, so I'm just waiting for my shift tonight. And while doing so, ay magbabahagi ako ng aking mga experiences as a medtech intern during my first, second, and third day. Start with day one. 
pumasok kami sa uh, pantry area where we will put our lab gowns. Kung nandun din yung DTR namin or like yung susulatan ng time in time out. We uh, proceed to doing the things that we will do or we should be doing dun sa mismong lab sections namin. Kasi, di ba, uh, one med tech per section. Tinuruan ni ma'am na mag receive ng samples, tapos yung mag-run ng sample sa CBC machine or complete blood count, and then yung pro-thrombin or active and activated partial thromboplastin time or APTT or PTT. Blood typing, kung how the machine works, tapos yung mga centrifuge, ganyan. Never receiving samples, ay may sticker doon, tapos may check mark dun sa lab section mo, then you have to um, your throw that or your stamp to indicate na na-acknowledge mo yung specimen. Pagkatapos ng specimen receiving, you have to log it dun sa mga log books dun sa lab. Ang pinaka nagustuhan ko doon ay yung blood typing. Meron kasing inpatient or kaya naman yung mga patient na nasa ospital, tapos merong outpatient, yung mga nagpupunta sa lab mismo, and then merong for ER. <laughs> While waiting for it, sabi ko, my gosh, kailangan super present yung mind mo talaga and bawal absent. Kasi kapag absent, how will you perform your tasks correctly? And you're dealing with uh, real patients na here, hindi na yung dapat uh, pwedeng magkamali. Ganyan, bawal talaga magkamali kasi very crucial yung results na lalabas doon. So, ang pinakamabenta sa lab ay CC section. And, uh, HEMA, pero may meron din sa IS. Kunwari, nag-request nag ako sa lab ng CVC, blood typing, and chem. So, yung one tube doon na lavender top or like EDTA tube ay for HEMA. And then, yung yellow top doon for CC. Ngayon, di boat siya dadalhin doon sa rocks. Pero magkaiba ng lalagyan. So, may kanyang ginagawa si CC area, tapos kami HEMA. So, very systematic. Tapos may mga barcodes. Uh, very organized. Hindi kasi talaga ako magaling magpipet. So, nung second day ko lang natutunan yung technique on how to do the proper pipeting. Like, um, hindi mo pala siya isasagad dun sa tube. Uh, ala ko, isasagad mo sa tube. Yun pala, dapat na yung konting ganyan. Like, space... So that, makapag-aspirate ng properly si Pipet. Uh, Doon ko na-appreciate talaga yung pagiging medtech. Iba pa rin yung experience na nandun ka na mismo at actual man ang ginagawa kaysa um, dinidiscuss lang sa'yo yung process or like pinapanood mo lang yung process on how to do it. So, iba talaga sa lab. Uh, so, may words of encouragement lang for the medtech students like me, like yung lower year pa. Uh, Ma-appreciate nyo more ang pinag-aaralan natin when you um, go to the laboratory na for internship. Kasi, uh, matutuwa kayo sa mga ginagawa natin doon. In regards to my night shift, um, hindi <laughs> naman ako nakatulog, guys. Sanay na naman ako magpuyo talaga dati pa, nung third year. Pero nung fourth year, I take it easy talaga kasi my health was declining. Kaya naman yung night shift. Pero mas gusto kang morning shift kasi madaming samples. Um, ayun. I'll get ready na for my shift this night. And see you guys on my next Quento session. I'll also be wearing another t-shirt besides my uniform because it's cold, so cold in the laboratory. Okay. One pocket here, one pocket here to the side and here too. And then here, and then here. With my nameplate and one uh, pocket here 
then two pockets here. Basically, this video is just me showing to you guys my daily routine as I prepare for my shift in the laboratory. So I haven't shown you so much of what I really do inside the lab because it's not allowed. So I tend to just story tell it to you guys because that's the best I could do. And on my next videos, I'm gonna show you what we are seeing in the microscope, but it's taken with permission. Fourth day done. everyone it's December 30 hindi naman masyadong toxic kasi nga night duty tapos mag new new year na so wala masyadong nagpapalab although marami pa rin tao but not as toxic as the other day gonna take a rest this will be the end of the video guys thank you so much for watching let me know in the comments what you want to include or what you want to know in my intern life vlogs stay safe and healthy everyone